the Wayne County Public Library in Honesville, Pennsylvania. Welcome to Eating the Alphabet One Letter at a Time. We are almost at the end of our alphabet. I am sad to report we need more letters in the alphabet. So let's get ready to talk about what letter we're up to next. Good morning. I'm glad you're here with me. Let's eat some letters. What letter should we eat today? Well, Let's sing our song and see what we're up to. Who's gonna sing with me? Let's go, we've got a lot of letters to sing because we're almost at the end. Hello, Brett Nealon. Let's sing our song. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Are you singing with me? Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X. What's next? Y. Today is letter Y. It's a beautiful letter, isn't it? So, Y makes a Y sound. Can you say Y, Y? What words do you think start with that sound? Let's, I'll give you some clues. There's a color. There's a color that starts with Y. Wouldn't be blue. Wouldn't be red. What would it be? Hello, Andrea. It would be, what color starts with the letter Y? Yellow. Yellow. How about... If I don't say no, what is this? Yeah, yeah, yes. How about an animal called a yak and a yam? And what do we do when we're tired? We yawn. So many great Y words. Uh, yummy is a Y word. Yeah, yeah, yummy. Yogurt is a Y word. Yeah. Yeah, yogurt. So why don't we make a yummy yogurt parfait today? Here's what you need. Little Miss Andrea, I'm so glad you're joining me today. All right, so here's what you need. We need oh, a couple of things, not much. We need yogurt. We need some fruit. I have some strawberries and peaches and pineapple and blueberries and you need some granola love granola and if you don't have granola you can use any kind of cereal you want i have a little bag of cheerios to show you what we can what we can do to these um, if you don't have granola okay and you need a fancy glass because it's so much fun to eat a yogurt parfait if you have a fancy glass. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna layer it. We're gonna put layers on. We're gonna put yogurt in the bottom of the glass and then we're gonna put granola, sprinkle granola, and then we're gonna put some fruit. And then we're gonna do yogurt again, granola and fruit. So we're almost making a pattern and if you were watching story time with me Wednesday, we talked about patterns. So listen to the pattern. Yogurt, granola, fruit. Then we repeat it yogurt, granola, fruit. And then we repeat it. Yogurt, granola, what will come next? That's right, fruit. So let's start, roll up our sleeves. I'm gonna put my yogurt in first. Smush it down. That's my first layer. And now I'm going to put some, sprinkle some granola in. I like a lot of granola because it's very crunchy. Now, if you don't have granola, here's what you can do. You can layer your Cheerios or any cereal on top of your yogurt or watch what you can do. You can, this is great grown-ups for their fine motor skills. Squish it, squish it, and squish in my Oh, you hear it? It makes a great noise. You can talk about the noise that it makes, grown-ups. Put it right next to your ear. Talk about sound. And look what I'm doing. I'm making 
my own little crunchy granola. So that's a, that's a, an option that you have. Okay, so I did my granola. I'm going to put a little bit more. And now I'm going to put my fruit in. I'm just going to layer my fruit. And a spoon. I need a spoon. We'll be here all day. Put my strawberries in. And the nice thing about the glasses, see, you can see it looks so pretty. Don't you want to come over here and eat my yogurt parfait? Just the best cook, aren't I? All right, so now I've got yo. Look how pretty it looks. See the layers? Yogurt, granola, fruit. So what comes next? Yogurt, granola, fruit. What do I put on top of it? Yogurt. Put a lot on this because now my layers are getting wider. And I smush it around, so I cover all my fruit. Each layer is covering the layer before it. It's almost like I'm frost putting frosting on it. Okay, can't see my fruit. Okay, yogurt. What comes next? Granola. Covering it up. I can't wait to eat this. This is a healthy breakfast. A little bit more. And our last layer is another layer of fruit. It's looking so pretty. This looks like something fancy you get at a restaurant when you go out. To get some breakfast. Betty's Breakfast Restaurant. Come on over. Oh, it's so beautiful. Wait till you make it. Are you making it with me this morning? Oh my goodness. And I think I'm going to end with just a little bit. Hi, Grayson. I'm going to end with just a little bit of granola on the top. If you had some shredded coconut, I have some of that. I should have put that out. That would be good to have on it. And there, look at this beautiful yogurt parfait. Usually, if I have yogurt, I'll just throw some fruit in. But now look at this fancy thing that I made. So, what do you think? It's a beaut. And that was it. Yogurt, granola, and fruit. That's it. And if you didn't have fruit, you could just do yogurt and granola, yogurt and granola. But the layers are what makes it so much fun and so interesting because every bite I'm going to take is going to taste different. So here we go. I'm going to go with my peach and yogurt and granola. Oh, so good. Crunchy and, and um, creamy from the yogurt. And the fruit gives it a nice little pop. Mm -hmm. I am very pleased with my yummy yogurt parfait. So if you make one, send me a picture because I love to see what you're making. Time to learn how to write the letter Y. Who's ready? Just raise your hand and say yes, because yes starts with Y. Okay, Ys are a little tricky. Let's look at a lot of slants in this. And a lot of our letters have had slants, right? The X slanted this way and this way. And the W slanted in, and then they slanted this way. A lot of slants in, al in alphabet letters. So here's what we have to do. We have to slant down this way and down this way, and then we have to put a little stem on them. Let's do it. We almost have to make like the letter V. This way, and then go up. And now make a little, a little stand for him to stand on. It wasn't so bad. Let's try it again. We go make a point. Now we have to go back up like a V. Are you doing it with me? 
Brett, how's your letter Y today? Brett is my, he is the one that always, I know he's always doing the letter with me. So, Y, yes, and yellow, and yak, and yam, and yummy, and yogurt. Good stuff. So, make your yogurt parfait. Talk about how yummy it is. Talk about things in your world, in your house that you see, that start with letter Y. Uh, letter Y. Like, if you have a room that's painted yellow. If you have food in your refrigerator that makes you so happy and it's so All right, my darlings, let's sing our alphabet song and see what our last letter of the alphabet is. Do you know what the last letter of the alphabet is? Let's sing it. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T U V W X. Today was Y, and next week is Z. The last letter of our alphabet, and it is a good snack. What can I make that starts with letter Z? It was tricky, but I found a good one. All right, have a good day. It's kind of rainy and dreary, but being here with you in my kitchen making this yummy yogurt parfait makes me feel a little less dreary so thanks for joining me have a nice day eat your yogurt parfait happy snacking everybody